I'm Jade Nepali Bay with TK Man SUP, and I'm about to do two things that I normally fall down a lot doing SUP and yoga. Let's go! SUP is an abbreviation for stand up paddling. These, the bays here on this west side of Mali are pretty unusually beautiful and actually super conducive to stand up paddling, like help, like user friendly. As long as you know how to swim, and if you, we offer lessons as well as rentals, so if you would like an instructor with you in the water for that extra level of safety, you know, to ease your apprehension, we have that. But, I mean, nothing's gonna happen to you. I'm really nervous to get into the yoga positions because I'm not a yoga person. Um, I, I'm flexible, I mean I danced for a really long time, but I'm, I'm not really into yoga like that. The first move I have to stop paddling, put my paddle on the board and get on all fours, which to be honest I feel pretty comfortable with. I'd say the best part about this lesson is really the instructor. He's making me feel so confident and assured of myself. I'm trying things that I don't think I would normally do but I feel like I can't fail. Stand-up paddleboard yoga actually sounds much more difficult than it is. I really think that anyone coming to Hawaii could give it a try and they would have a lot of fun and they'd get a really great workout. We're not the typical, you know, surf guys. We, we like to take care of our guests and make sure you guys have a good time. Like not just teach you how to do it, but actually, you know, like connect and have fun with you guys. But anyone can do it. As long as they feel comfortable in their own physical abilities, then we're here to help them and, and keep them safe. Grannies to kids. Kids actually can sit on and I can paddle them around, you know, like kings or queens. So they enjoy it. They don't have to work. And um, grannies, <laughs> they want that too, I think. Yeah. <laughs> but, <Aww>. you know. <laughs> From Tiki Man SUP, I'd like to say mahalo and ahui ho.